The bond between animals and humans is unimaginably strong. When we develop that deep connection, it doesn't matter how different our species may be, the love affects us forever. Even if we have to part for a while, the reunion can turn out to be extremely emotional. From the woman who rescued a lion to a post-COVID reunion, let's take a look at the 20 most heartwarming animal reunions with owners. <sighs> Number 20. Anna Julia Torres I'm going to take a wild guess and say that, for most people, spending time with a lion is not what would be considered a fun time, but Anna Julia Torres is not most people. In fact, she's a pretty unique human being in that she has absolutely no fear of these animals whatsoever. Anna Julia Torres has owned and ran the Villa Lorena Animal Sanctuary in Cali, Colombia for over 30 years. Torres takes an abused or mistreated animals and nurses them back to health, reminding them of the love and appreciation they have long forgotten. One of these animals was Jupiter. This lion was born and brought up in a circus, easily one of the most abusive and cruel places for any animal to grow up, but Anna took it upon herself to bring Jupiter home and take care of him. Did she do a good job? That depends on who you ask. Anna claims that she takes care of the animals as if they're her own children, but some have claimed she's just as abusive as the owners she claims to loathe. However, just take a look at the moment that Jupiter is reunited with Anna, and you'll see the truth. He adores her. This is the woman that rescued him from a brutal life and showed him the value of love. And you can't put a price on that. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Number 19. The COVID Dogs I don't think I have to say how chaotic an effect the COVID-19 pandemic has had on our lives. We all know it, we all see it, we're all still feeling it every single day. But one group had it especially hard. The dogs separated from their owners. Because of work or other factors, some dog owners had to stay away from their beloved pups. When they returned to the country, they had to quarantine or self-isolate, meaning their pups had to go weeks without seeing their beloved humans. So when this woman finally returned home, her dog could not wait to finally see her. I mean, look at this and tell me it does not bring you joy. Getting to see a loved one again after a long time is the greatest gift we can get during this difficult time. And even dogs agree, hopefully the pandemic will eventually come to some sort of an end, but until then we're pretty much gonna have to muddle through. And if that means we get a few more videos of dogs absolutely losing their minds seeing their owners, well, I think I could possibly cope with that. Number 18. Jin Jing the Penguin how far would you go to thank the man who saved your life? Well, given that humans are fundamentally lazy, I imagine many people would probably go as far as the store to buy chocolate or something, which they would then mail, or they'd just do all of the above on Amazon and go absolutely nowhere. But luckily for our video, penguins don't care for Amazon. They have to make a little more effort. This is Jinjing, a South American Magellanic penguin who really goes the extra mile for the man who saved his life. Or should I say the extra 5,000 miles? Every single year this penguin swims over 5,000 miles to a beach in Brazil just to see Joao Piera de Souza. In 2011, this man found Jinjing lying on the rocks at his local beach, covered in oil and dying. Joao rescued the penguin, named him, cleaned the oil from his feathers, and fed him on a daily fish diet until he was all well enough to return to the wild. But Jinjing had developed a strong bond with this human, and he wasn't just going to leave. Eleven months later, Jinjing was finally ready to return to the wild. But within months, Jinjing returned to the beach to see Joao, clearly demonstrating love and appreciation unlike any other. Penguins, man. That's where the true loyalty lies. Number 17. 
Hype Dogs. I'm gonna go out on a limb here and say that there is nothing as adorable as a dog welcoming its owner home. The way the little pup will jump on the window just to watch and wait. Adorable. When you walk in and they jump up at you. So cute. Take a look at these beautiful beagles, who naturally know their owners are coming home. There's something so cute and moving about the way they just sit and wait, and then, when they finally appear, the dogs just lose all their cool and start jumping around, hyped as ever to see their beloved friends and family. They even lick the baby's face as a way of showing their total affection. Man, we are so lucky to have dogs in our lives, aren't we? Even the baby is speechless about this unconditional affection. This family is unbelievably lucky to have these beautiful, loving dogs waiting for them at home. No matter what they may do or experience, they know they will always have the affection and love of their beautiful pets. And isn't that all we can ask for, really? That and somebody to cook all our meals for us? Number 16. Lucy the Pig what would you do if your pig was stolen? Well, since most of you probably don't own a pig, you'd probably be very surprised. But if you do happen to have a pig, well, congratulations, you win the unusual pet contest this time around. Bianca Sierra is one of these unique pet owners. To her, Lucy the pig is just as adorable and important as any dog or cat. I understand, it's a pig, it's not a typical pet, but... My Which made it all the more heartbreaking to discover that Lucy the pig had been hognapped. According to neighbors, two strange men had turned up, grabbed Lucy, and began wrestling her into their tiny red car. Honestly, you'd think that a whole pig napping would be orchestrated to revolve around a more suitable vehicle, but hey, I guess pig nappers aren't all that smart. In fact, they were idiots. Shortly after the pig napping, one man saw Lucy in the street near a Home Depot. Concerned she would be hit by a car and turned into bacon, he rescued her and kept her safe for the night. The following morning, Lucy the pig was returned to her home and owner, who was understandably thrilled to have her beloved hog back home. They even celebrated Lucy's birthday soon after. Hope they pigged out. Number 15. Shadow the German Shepherd German Shepherds are notoriously intimidating dogs. They can be fierce, they can be intense, they can even be aggressive if trained to be so. But one thing that is usually not even mentioned, they can be straight up adorable. Shadow the German Shepherd was very close to the camera guy's brother, but of course, duty calls, and the brother had to go away for a while to do his work. Six months later, Shadow was missing his buddy and probably thinking that he'd never see him again. Guess again, friend. The camera guy arranged for the dog to be reunited with his best friend. And he was there to capture the whole thing for hashtag content. Sure enough, as soon as the car arrives, it's like the German Shepherd understands what's happening. It's like he becomes a puppy at the sight of him, trying to climb into the car and everything. It's obvious that this dog absolutely loves his best friend, even climbing into the car as if to say, I'm never leaving you again. Or maybe this is his way of looking around and saying, wow, you really need to clean your car. Either way, it's true. Number 14. Lion Hug Would you hug a fully grown lion? How about two? If the answer is no, you're probably a very smart person. You'll live for a while. But if you're one of the people who said yes, well, you're living on the edge. But you also have a heart. You're probably not going to live long, but hey, you'll have a good time. Malkia and Adele are two lions who were rejected by their mothers when they were just cubs. Rather than letting them die in the wild, these cubs were handed over to a big cat rescue center in Slovakia and were raised with humans as their parents. So I guess it makes sense that when Michaela Zimanova paid them a visit, they just couldn't help but rush over to embrace her. She's family now, and that's why Michaela heads there up to three times a month just to see him. In fact, she's one of only three people allowed to have this kind of close contact. But be honest with me, if you were given the opportunity to do this, to have lions run right up to you and hug you, would you take it? Or would you be more safety conscious? I guess what I'm really asking is, how much do you value your face? 
Number 13. Donkey Reunion In a way, humans are a lot like ogres. We have layers, like onions. We also have a lot of love for donkeys. Some of us more than others, but the point is, we like Shrek, because Shrek is love and Shrek is life. Anyway, this guy loves a donkey and we're gonna celebrate it. Ismail Fernandez lives in Andalusia, and his life is all about his favorite lady, his donkey. Yes, Baldamira is a donkey and Ismail's best friend. So when Andalusia went into lockdown during the first wave of COVID-19, both were understandably devastated to be taken away from one another. That unfortunate separation went on for two months, meaning these best friends were away from one another longer than ever before. Luckily, Ismail's brother was on hand to look after and take care of Baldamira, but they were all just patient waiting for this day, the day that the lockdown restrictions finally lifted. Ismail calls out, Baldo, and she rushes up to him, nosily reacting to his stroking. And by reacting, we mean crying. Ismail later described it as the most touching moment of his life. And we can see why, right? The video became such a viral sensation that Ismail started an Instagram account for Baldemira. Now that's definitely something Shrek would never do. Number 12. Puppy Welcomes Owner Look, we could just fill this video with clips of dogs welcoming their humans home, and I think we'd all be okay with that. We're not going to do that, of course, but hey, what's the harm in another adorable puppy video, right? There's not much set up for this video besides the obvious. This puppy is so excited to welcome his human back home. According to science, the puppy knows this human is on their way thanks to his sensitive hearing. The more you know, eh? Anyway, so the puppy patiently waits for the sound of approaching footsteps, but it turns out he doesn't actually know what to expect. He's just excited about the prospect of somebody appearing. As you can see from that cute little tail wag, Then, when he realizes somebody is coming home, his excitement just builds and builds until cuteness overload. This is the kind of thing that every single dog owner on the planet lives for. No other living creature on this planet will consistently show such excitement to see your face like a dog. Seriously, those of you who are married will relate to that one. Number 11. Anita and the Wolves if I were to create a whole new band, Anita and the Wolves would certainly be up there as a candidate for the name. I mean, my name's not Anita, but it could be for the band, I guess. I don't know what I'm talking about, so let's look at the Wolves. Anita is a woman who absolutely adores wolves. <laughs> I mean, she really, really loves and connects with them. Here in Norway, Anita was working long and hard to connect with the wolves in Polar Zoo. It sounds like the kind of task that nobody would ever want to take up, and yet she clearly mastered it. This video was captured after Anita returned to Polar Zoo after two months. And look what happened. As soon as the wolves saw her, they rushed over to lick her face. That classic dog kiss. It's pretty obvious that Anita has some special resonance with these wolves. They treat her as if she's a member of their own pack. Is that safe? Is it a good thing? It kind of depends on your point of view, but in my opinion, if they're not ripping your face off, it's certainly a good day. Number 10. Russell the Monkey Monkeys, they're just like us. Except for, you know, flinging their poop and generally being kind of a pain in the butt. Actually, they sound exactly like us. Wow, they sound exactly like us. I really thought we had evolved further. Anyway, this little guy is Russell. Russell is a small monkey that lives with a loving family, and if you have any doubt about how Russell feels about that, well, you're about to find out. Russell's human mommy decided to take the monkey with the family when they collected their human daughter Sissy from the airport. Following a three-day trip, I don't think any of them really expected just how excited Russell would get to see her. Just in case you're worried he did not fling poop at any point, 
just wanted to get that one out of the way as quickly as possible. From the second that Russell sees Sissy, he gets incredibly excited, and you can see it. He immediately leaps into her arms and gives her a hug and a kiss, and even just the look on his face screams of happiness. That smile? This is a strange pet to have. Sure, but clearly both Monkey and Mommy are very happy about the whole thing. I imagine the landlord isn't, but hey, that's his problem. Number 9. Patient Golden Retriever Dogs do not like to be abandoned. I mean, nobody does, right? It kinda sucks to spend so much time with somebody and then just get ditched or abandoned, and yet dogs remain fiercely loyal no matter what. This is Bailey. Bailey is hyper excited that his owners finally came back after a one month vacation. Despite their best efforts, they couldn't find a way to bring him with them, so they had to leave him with his grandfather. He had a good time, of course, but, well, mom and dad are just so special to him, so special that when they finally returned, he, uh, well, you can see. This level of excitement is pretty much on par with giving your child an all-you-can-eat candy buffet. Just pure chaotic hyperactive energy. Of course, the owners did have to make an agreement with Bailey as an apology for leaving for so long. To avoid any more hurt or boredom, they promised to never go on vacation for this long ever again. And if they did, Bailey would be coming with them. Never again would he be left alone. Now that is good parenting. Number 8. Wolfie the Husky Going on vacation is one thing, but being away from your dog for two years? That's really rough. Even more so if it's something that you just can't help. That's the situation that happened with Wolfie and his human mother. But thankfully, here's a happy ending to the story. When Wolfie was first brought home as a little pup, his owner was unable to be there 24-7 due to work duties. However, Wolfie's grandmother quickly stepped in to take care of the little guy and soon became Wolfie's adoptive mother. When Wolfie began having seizures, she was there for him always. But then, when Wolfie was just one year old, Mama moved back to Korea. Two years later, Wolfie's owner decided to give him a surprise by flying Grandmama back over to see her favorite boy, and her son too, I guess. Wolfie, of course, lost his mind. As soon as he saw her, he leapt up into her arms and refused to leave her side. After all, this is the woman who basically raised him, right? She was there for him through all of the difficult and troubling times. So why would he ever abandon her or go somewhere else? Family never abandon family. I learned that from Vin Diesel. Number 7. Limbani the Chimp Chimps are among the most intelligent creatures on our planet, and we all know it ain't the humans. These incredible creatures solve puzzles. They can learn to understand gestures and language. They can even communicate with us. And it turns out they remember us. When he was a baby, Limbani was born with pneumonia. As a result of his condition, his mother rejected him, focusing her attention on her other babies. But Limbani wasn't abandoned by everybody. Tanya and George George Sanchez became his human caretakers using the wonders of modern medicine to save him. When Limbani was finally healthy, he was handed over to the Zoological Wildlife Foundation, who have taken care of him ever since. But don't go thinking he's forgotten about his old friends. Tanya and George decided to make a visit to the ZWF just to see Limbani, not knowing if he would even remember them. As it turns out, he remembered them extremely well. Limbani's excitement is palpable and clear from the second he sees them. He runs straight into Tanya's arms, giving her a warm and passionate hug. With that out of the way, he turns his attention to George. Time passes, sure, but the memories, the gratitude, and the feeling of love, well, that stays forever. Or at least until he decides he hates the food he's getting. But you know, that could well be forever. Number 6. Cat Reacts to Owner Cats have a reputation for being aloof, uncaring. So it's fair to wonder how they react to an owner returning home. Do they care? Do they get excited? Or do they just shrug it off and go back to sleep like I would? 
Let's find out, shall we? Obviously, this cat had absolutely no idea that she was being recorded, but after hearing the sound of somebody outside the door, the cat makes a move, hoping to get a little more information. She jumps on the side table and patiently waits. When the door finally opens, the cat greets him by falling to his feet and even offering him a curious little back end, allowing him to kiss her stomach. To non-cat owners, this probably looks kind of strange, but this is one of those tiny gestures that probably made this guy's day. Even an animal as nonchalant and casually cool as the cat can be full of warmth and love. Do dogs leap into your arms and just go limp? Not usually, but this cat wanted some attention, and you bet she knew how to get it. You have to appreciate that at least. Number 5. Golden Retriever Living with a member of the military can't be easy. You're talking about people who give up much of their lives to serve their country, often without the guarantee of returning home. Now imagine what that must be like from a dog's perspective. It could be pretty heartbreaking, but not for Ashi. Thankfully, Ashi is here, eagerly waiting for his mom Nancy to come home. Nancy is a Marine, and she's about to return home from a long trip abroad. The second that door opens, she steps into the house, and you can see Ashi completely completely lose his mind, the adorable golden furball just can't stop giving her kisses and jumping around. If you look closely enough, you may even see a few tears of joy from the little doggo. And as for Nancy, well, she's more than happy to just settle in and let Ashi shower her with his joy and appreciation. It didn't matter how long Nancy had been away, Ashi missed her so much that he would always have lost his mind like this upon her return. Some bonds are so special that no amount of time apart will ever diminish them. Nancy and Ashi have one of those bonds, and I, for one, am glad we got to witness it. Number 4. Cats Welcome Owner Home it's a question that many people have. Do cats even recognize their owners after a long absence? We know, of course, that dogs certainly do, but as it turns out, cats also have a very good memory. In fact, they may be better at remembering faces than dogs. This owner was returning home after two months away, and as you can see, her kitties are hyped and ex- uh oh okay, ma okay, maybe not. So these cats are, um pretty disinterested about their owner returning home after such a long time away. But hey, I'm sure they're happy on the inside, right? Probably. Uh, here's the thing with cats. If you have just one interaction with a cat, she will probably remember you for about 16 hours. But in terms of long-term memory, well, they're about 200 times better at remembering faces than dogs. So if you happen to get familiar with a little kitty, don't worry about it. They're never going to forget you, but don't expect them to be thrilled about you coming home either. As you can see from the video, some cats will react to their owners returning as a result sounding, where the hell have you been, moron? Number 3. Cat Welcome Soldier What really counts as a soldier's welcome? Well, it's not necessarily required, but I'm of the belief that a cat should always be there. However, I'll also admit that this rule is based entirely on the video you're about to see. It's just way too dang adorable. Meet Finn. And make no mistake, Finn has been waiting all dang day for his owner to finally come home and pay some attention to him. His owner, Nick, is a soldier coming home after a long trip abroad, and look what happens when Nick finally arrives home. It's as if Finn knows that he's coming, allowing himself to get more and more excited, until finally the door swings open and human finally arrives. And naturally, Finn leaps up into Nick's arms for a cuddle and a little bit of attention. How cute is that? Finn's brother Boo, on the other hand, eh, could not give a damn about the human returning into their lives. All he wants is his food, and he's clearly not all that bothered about which walking sentient meat sack has to put it into his bowl. Hey, no judgment from me. A meal's a meal, right buddy? Number 2. 
Horse and Owner Reunion so we've covered dogs and cats and even pigs, but what about horses? Is it possible that even horses are capable of remembering a human face? The answer is pretty much exactly what you expect it is. But hey, we need to talk for a certain amount of time here, so let's pretend it's a mystery. When this young woman came home from college after a long time away, the very first thing she did was call out for her horse. I'm not sure she quite expected what happened next. Yeah, all of the horses came running to see her again. Doesn't that just melt your heart? According to science, horses do indeed remember their owners, not unlike how they remember another horse. Their memories, experiences, even auditory cues like the sound of our voice all help the horse to comprehend and remember who we are to them. So yes, horses, they're just like us. There's no way this woman expected the whole welcome party to come out just for her, but I'm sure she was absolutely thrilled to see it. Clearly, she's loved quite a lot by her beautiful horses, and that's the sign of a strong bond between any human and animal. This is really just making me think my cat hates me. Number 1. Monkey Cries now, let's wrap this up with an animal that is near and dear to us as humans. The chimp. Chimps are intelligent. They're wily, they can be a pain in the butt if they really want. But let's ask the question we keep coming back to. Can they actually remember humans? This video shows a monkey in a cage, crying out for something or someone. It seems he's in distress, bothered by something. Eventually, a woman approaches his cage, and it suddenly all makes sense. When she gets down and hugs him through the bars of the cage, it becomes clear that this woman is his owner, or at the very least, a human that developed a strong and intense bond with him. Now that he's behind bars, it seems that the chimp really does remember her, and he was crying out for her to come and give him some affection and love. So to go back to our question, can chimps remember humans? According to scientific studies, chimps are even smarter than we ever imagined. These animals actually have a photographic memory, which is extremely rare in humans, but in chimps, they can remember every single human face they've ever encountered, as well as the emotions that they felt around that person. What did I tell you? These are fiercely intelligent animals. What does your pet do when you come home? Let us know in the comments. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time.